My grandpa lost his tongue during World War II. Yeah, he never talks about it. My grandpa said that I'm too reliant on technology. So I told him he was a hypocrite and I unplugged his life support. I wasn't close to my grandpa when he died. And I'm glad because he stepped on a landmine. My grandpa fell into the well and he died because he couldn't see that well. My grandparents fought during World War II. They ended up getting a divorce. I want to die peacefully in my sleep like my grandpa, not screaming like the passengers in his car. During World War II, my grandpa single-handedly killed 30 German pilots. He was the crappiest mechanic that the Luftwaffe ever had. During a church service, my grandfather leans over to his wife and whispers, I just let out a fart. It was silent. What should I do now? Grandma responds, you need to change the batteries in your hearing aid. One of my favorite childhood memories was building sandcastles with my grandpa. Then my mom hid the urn from me. My grandpa was so cheap that when he dies, he'll probably walk towards the light and then turn it off. Grandpa always told me to find a woman that's smart, a woman that's great in bed, and a woman that loves you for who you are. And make damn sure none of these women ever meet each other. My grandpa would always tell me that when he was growing up, his mama used to give him a dollar and send him down to the corner store. He'd come back with two loaves of bread, a half gallon of milk, a carton of eggs, and a pound of pork. He says, you can't do that nowadays. There's way too many security cameras. My granddaughter has been learning about astronomy in school. She asked me if I knew how stars died. And I told her, usually from an overdose. I'll never forget my grandfather's last words to me. Are you still holding the ladder? My grandpa told me that when he was small, the alphabet only had 25 letters. Nobody knew why. My grandpa always says that when one door closes, another one opens. He was a really good man, but a lousy cabinet maker. My late grandpa used to hate looking in the mirror. He was a humble man, but a terrible driver. My grandpa returned from the war with one leg. We still don't know who that leg belonged to. My grandpa fought in the war and survived mustard gas and pepper spray. He's now classified as a seasoned veteran. My grandpa knew that the Titanic was going to sink. He said it loudly countless times, and then he got kicked out of the theater. My grandpa died this weekend. He led a simple life, loved by family and friends while enjoying a long career as a crop duster. In accordance with his final wishes, his cremated remains will be mixed with water and sprayed over the seashore where he spent his final days. He will be missed.